on the five metre line now. Took them 15 phases to get there. Good tackle from the gold. Are they going to swing it wide? Here they come. It comes over the top. Windsor out now. It looks like it might be a try, and it is. I got so excited, I lost my headset. <laughs> Dan okay. Moore, Dan Moore. Just <laughs> pick it up for you, Mark. Oh, well done, Dan Moore. He's been busy in this game, and what a great finish. And it all came from some slick hands and a great pass from Sean Windsor. Wow, Mark, you see how long that try took to develop. I mean, how many phases was that? 20, 24? That was a lot. There were, and it started actually way back here in front of the 22 meter line when Moonlight kept that ball in that great run and didn't go out of bounds. You know, Gold, uh, Gold was trying to push him out, which would have completely changed the, uh, the, the, the pace of that possession. Uh, but boy, keeping it in hand, moving it through the forwards, getting it out to the backs, and then that key pass. You're like uh, sending a rocket into his players and they've come out they've done exactly that they needed to do something different and look at them again making a break nearly tackled out the ball there but it's been all the arrows in this second half great hands on and that's going to be a try what a play from spencer jones sending dan moore in for his second try of the match fantastic effort and here they come the toronto arrows from canada any sense of this being a runaway game for nola gold just evaporated with that try uh they started this the, the second half with a 17 point lead down to five right now awaiting the conversion and that was a really nice try mark you see how that started with a run by one of the big forwards <laughs> making an unexpected break definitely a missed tackle there for gold hey Dan Moore gets his second try but he almost had three if you remember he got right near the try zone literally right after the first try he got this half he's on fire right now Mark. he's having a fantastic game oh trying to looking for the knock on no no it's good no such luck but it does go back over to Toronto and comes away Donardo there quickly Jordan measures this one. A charge down. Set back the other way. Opportunity for the arrows. No, it's fine. It's fine. No, try it. They finish it. It is a try for Toronto. They are back in the driver's seat here in Texas. The captain Dan Moore able to get to it. And what a huge turn. Austin knocking on the door. It looked like they were going to come away with the try. Turned it over, sent the other way over the top. A beautiful ball. I believe that was Spencer Jones. Jordan, the other way, tried to relieve pressure, was charged down by Moore. Yes. And One Moore able to get on top of it. There's another look, and that appears to be the correct call. He got it down for the arrows try. All of your tries for the visitors from understudies ready to step up when given the opportunity, including tonight, your captain, Dan Moore. Morgan Mitchell. One meter out. Toronto already up 14 nothing. The eight man, Colby Francis, a late ad is an eight man, by the way. Mike Shepard, this one wide. This is gonna be in. Dan Moore dots it down. And there'll be a discussion and a try awarded. 19 to nothing, Dan Moore, the captain, the 28 year old, 14 caps for Canada. One try today, his fourth of the season, 19-0. Yeah, well, the back said, hey, Fords, you've done enough. Let us have a turn. And then they put it out the back. Sam Malcolm, great pass over the top and then dots down in the corner. Great try for the Arrows. It's just too easy right now, Jerem. The Warriors aren't doing anything to stop the bleeding. 10-12 combo, both from Australia. And the first knock-on, and that is from... The former Canadian international Hugh Bikes in Toronto on the way, looking for help. Dan Moore gonna get a pass, and he scores the first try, and history made one minute into the contest. John Moonlight scored the first ever try in Major League Rugby for Toronto. Dan Moore, the captain, scores the first ever Arrows try at home, and playing the advantage on the knock-on, a mishandle from Nola Gold, and Toronto takes advantage, just 80 seconds in, already on the board. The gift from one Canadian to the other, and Hugh Bikes hey guys, can't find the handle. A really nice break there by Spencer These Jones. Are very difficult to see. And a good trailing support line by Moore. He doesn't have to do a whole lot, catch and dive, and that's all he needs 
I'm good for now. Does it well and five pointer for the arrows. Quickly freeing it up. And that's where you appreciate those hands of Rob Brower a moment ago. Indeed. Advantage Not over. always easy for the big men to recover. Off to the races. Slipping into gear. The captain, Dan Moore, to the rescue. And what a run, what a try from the captain Moore, the Toronto native. Looks like he was going to go inside, able to step Turner and turned on the Jets. A huge try for the Arrows. And you see the response, the emotional response from Moore. Look at it right here. Just got to Turner, found the extra gear. Turner, unable to keep up with him. Arrows growing confident. They may have a winning streak. It is Andrew Quatrin, the 22-year-old from Holland Landing, Ontario. Able to find support Advantage at the back, offside. and he is offside, Fawcett. So they do have a free play here. They go around the back. Excellent work. Levis trying to free the arms to Moore, over. and it will go to the corner, and Moore will score. Toronto answers right back. It's an Arrows tie by the It's Dan Moore, the captain, with the try, but give Polo Levis, the Uruguayan left wing, a ton of credit. A beautiful run. He drew the defender, was able to get his hands free, made a difficult pass on to Moore. And Moore, no trouble across. And the conversion pending, a chance to tie it up. You see it again here, great look. And Colo Levas, tough running, something that he is known for, the Uruguayan. And look at this pass, going down, still able to get yeah. the offload. Nothing Leonard could okay, do about you. that. So hard to defend against a 10 that throws a good ball at the line. The arrows here knocking on the door. They'd love another try. If he Asiata, he love five points next to his name. Cap off a great night already for his arrows debut. Mackenzie, quick hands. Yana already five points. They come right again. Quick hands will do it more in the corner. Beautiful ball from Adam Zoe. Flat cut out pass to Moore. And the skipper gets five, and you can see him thanking his fly half right there. Beautiful lead-up work from the number 10 from New Zealand. Well, there was some really, really good play there by Toronto. They were able to play with pace. You can see this is from a kick from Elan Puddock, which I'm not sure he really wants to do. He needs to keep that ball in hand. And we said they've got space wide. And look at what Moore does. He comes back inside so he doesn't get pushed out of bounds. They're able to move that ball quickly. A couple of actually really, really good plays. There was um, Cole Keith who had a great break as a tight head prop through the middle. Asiata not using that pod. Stop, stop, Low guys. driving kick there from Flav Taylor Adams. Forces Isdale all the way back. He's with Freda, 23-year-old. Puts him on his left boot. Stop here, stop well positioned though is Adams. Such an entertaining player. Oh, and he finds the ball back on the inside. It's magic, here we go! It's a free run to the line! Dan Moore! Doesn't need the hair salon, it just blows in the wind! Oh, and what a celebration! Moore's pure gold! And that's a fabulous try. That, that's exactly why they are playing these kick tennis exchanges. They back their back three, they back their counter attack. That time Taylor Adams, a fly half, little bit of magic, made the decision to run, goes down the blind side, gets that perfect ball away, and that's what unleashes more eventually. Watch this, the ability to get the point. It might have come on for Houston Han initially, but that's what set it up on the short side. Houston bid in, he got the ball away, then they perfectly finished that off two on one to get down more away on the corner, and a nice little celebration there as well. Randall brings that down at two. Now they go midfield with Dutois. Get up, Eric. Ferguson quickly. Oh, big hit comes in there. Yep. De La Vega on the receiving end. As now they go wide, they poke through the other side. Oh, Four. Dan Moore, he dots it down for the try. Very confident. We have timeout. Maybe going to look at an obstruction and the sideline here. My only two thoughts, Pete. Well, Dan Moore is a great finisher. And look at this line. 
by Lesage on the outside. And that pass, he went to the left, pass to the right, and a great finish. Really, really beautiful. But it's the seawall. Oh, it's Barton. So it's Canadian on Canadian action there. Barton will be disappointed with that. I'm going to get out of your way, I promise. Yep. Just wait, boys. Be patient. There we go. Good Smith. stuff. He peels away, picks up. Looks like Staller there. A Turner, sorry. Now Shepard. There you go. There'll be no thoughts of kicking here for Seattle. They're going to run this one. There's a clock almost expires here as we approach 80 minutes. Toronto. Out okay, we go, boys. Up we get. A little bit of revenge for that loss. And they'll put the icing on the cake as Dan Moore gets his second at the match. And the arrows, there's the exclamation mark there's on this performance. 37-17 with a kick to come. I was just going to say, maybe a little revenge for that semi-final loss. I'm sure they won't be satisfied, though, until they avenge yeah, it in so. a semi-final match. Well, Dan, you and I both know that while it hasn't been a big conversation for the Toronto Arrows, it has been a conversation this week. They felt like they the first 20 minutes against Seattle in the semi-final was a problem so. yeah, for them. Yeah, and after that, they were actually the better team. So they came out here with some real determination and the pressure. I mean, there's not much Seattle can do. They're trying to do something. But